a heat advisory, of course, in effect for all of Oneida County right now. And that heat is not letting up for high school players as they continue to practice to get ready for their first games of the season. News Channel 2's Sarah Williams has more. It's official, as you can see behind me, preseason high school fall sports are underway, but the heat is on. Not only the potential games that are coming up, but right here on the practice field where the heat index is currently reaching 90 degrees. Yeah, it, it does get pretty warm out here sometimes. It's very, very warm. Um, I'm doing minimal activity and I'm standing here still sweating, so. I mean, it's, it's pretty hot out here, but it's... It's not terrible. Under partly cloudy skies and a bright sun peeking through, the players on the field are feeling the heat but staying hydrated. We have mandatory water ups about every 30 minutes. Uh, obviously, we keep track of any dehydration, any change in their behavior, but uh, we, we have water breaks probably more than we probably should uh, during a, a preseason practice. Players are drinking water before practice, during practice, and even on the way home. With some of the gear contributing to adding on extra heat, staying hydrated is important. With your shin guards, they're kind of big and bulky. You got your shorts, they just protect you. And then this part, it's like a softball thing. You got your neck guard, your helmet, and then your stick and your glove. So are you hot? Oh yeah, <laughs> I'm sweating. <laughs> but even under the summer sun, athletes are gearing up for their first game this week, understanding that game day could also offer the same condition. You just got to pace yourself and know when you know what you can do, but you also got to push yourself at the same time. It's the only way you're going to get better. In Herkimer, Sayura Williams, News Channel 2.